come closer. Your captain needs you. There's something wrong. I'm not feeling right. What happened? That devil storm. What in the nine hells was that about? And where is my box? I need my box. Did you take it? You build rat. I don't have the box. Something isn't right. To come so close. It's not fair. What, what's happening to me? I can't die. Not like this. <laughs> Sir, you seem to have melted. I want to go there. Why is that mountain like that? But into the smoke we go. If you see any numbers, let me know. Okay, game over. New character. <laughs> uh. As far as uh, MMO tutorial areas go, that's actually kind of cool. Short, sweet. I had some uh, story there. I did skip the initial cutscene. Not again. So did you. Proximity. <laughs> okay. up some flood. Some bait, some bushes.
Another player. Need to run around like a lunatic. lunatic. Clear all the bush. Another survivor. <laughs> Saints be praised. It's always good to find a live one. That storm was fierce. Figured it would drown the lot of you. Who are you? Me? Oh, I'm Charity. Uh, Watcher Douglas. The Monarch's Bluff Settlement. And who do I have the pleasure of meeting today? My name is Imperial Salt. Well, I know this isn't the best way to make an acquaintance, but it's actually the way most people arrive here. I suppose you're still wondering where here is. I would like to know where here is. Give me my boots. You've washed ashore on the Isle of Eternum. It's hard for me to even remember the old world these days, but I know it was very different. What's so different about Eternum? On the good side, you generally don't ever age or die here. At least, not in any natural way. On the bad side, there's what happened with the rest of your crew. What happened to them? Well, see, they came back to life, but without their souls. They're wandering around the beach all aimless-like. The kind thing is to at least try and put them down for good. Would you mind? Yeah, there's this one dude on the boat who kept on stealing my uh, ra rations, and this is my perfect time to get back at him. Oh, uh, as much as I can. I mean, does killing his body again count? That hurt. Let's see some ammunition and an arrow or some arrows. Nifty cash. Let's uh, put this on. Those fancy boots. Okay, so I'm back. I murdered my friends. I didn't see the guy who kept on stealing my rations. I know you didn't enjoy that. But once their souls are gone, it's the most you can do for them. I wish I could say you eventually get used to it, but you don't. 
Not really. Speak for speak for yourself though. It's actually very fun. Enlight enlightening. It's uh like committing murder, but you have to do it. Oh dear. Where are your manners, Charity? I'm sorry. After everything you've been through today, you're probably starving, aren't you? Do you have something to eat? Oh, I didn't think to bring anything, but I can show you how to make do. Get some flint and wood, then make yourself a skinning knife at the fire. That's a start, at least. But I, I can't eat a knife. I mean, I can try to eat a knife. I know back in the old world, people gave me random stuff to eat, but they never, ever gave me a knife. Ah, there's a first time for everything. Since I'm here, uh, let's see, a sickle would be, uh, might be tasty. The mining pick also might be, um, I mean, all the flavors definitely sort of the haft. It's the, uh, flint head that might be difficult to swallow. It's like eating a banana. Definitely, definitely. Maybe a logging axe would be the tastiest. Alright. So I've made everything. So how do I eat this knife? Got your skinning knife, eh? It's not exactly pretty, but it'll do the job. I mean, don't feel bad. I've certainly seen worse. Um... Skinny knife. I, I eat this now, right? This is this is food. Skinny knife is food. All right. Now that you've got your little knife, you can rustle up a meal. There's lots of boar about. Cut one down, skin it, roast the meat on the fire, and that should tide you over. That sounds like a plan, but you made it seem like that you had nothing to eat here, and you were offering me to make a knife and eat it. Pick yourself a fat one if you can. This is actually a good hunting spot. Um, okay. Uh, I'll look for a fat one. Uh, interesting uh, person to come across after wrecking on this island? Not even sure I even wrecked. I mean, I killed my captain. That's about it. I think I killed my captain. My captain may have killed me. Is this the afterlife? Oh, there's a boar. See, I have this perfectly good sword here. Why do I need a skinny knife? I mean, sure, precision and everything, but a sword will work just nicely. Might be a little dull, but hey, metal chunks and, uh, Meat never killed anyone before. Put on some my snazzy pants. I look like a proper sailor. Fire. Let's see. Make all the ration. This is gonna be tastier than the uh, hard tack I've been sucking on since uh, my way over. Cold beach like this? Oh, nothing like a warm meal by the fire. I bet you're glad you took the time. I'm disappointed that I didn't get to eat the knife. I hope it doesn't seem like life is just a misery here. Some people quite like it. And the weather here in Monarch's Bluffs is nice. Most of the time. So people don't die here? Not most of the time. 
and most of us don't even age. It's something to do with the blue Azoth. It's just not always predictable. Some age, some don't, some die, some don't, and then some come back as corrupted or lost. Interesting. Anything else you need help with? I'm afraid so. That was a freak storm that wrecked your ship. All these ships. I mean, it's corruption that causes storms off the coast all the time. That was the worst I've ever seen. What is the corruption? Can you eat it? It's that nasty red stuff, kind of... an evil magic. Being corrupted is even worse than being lost. The corruption forms a ring around Eterna and smashes any ships approaching and any that try to leave. Is there a way to fight it? Storms are just a fact of life here. The best we can do is keep records of all the ships corruption claims. In fact, you could scrub these ships for any keepsakes. The settlement will want them. Okay, sounds like a plan. Later, have a little snack. Ah, uh, let me check my pockets. I believe I am missing something. Maybe there's a little sheet that gives me information about what I need. So I'm going to refer to that. Aha! Let's see. Uh, back in the old world, I wasn't that strong. But I did like to be quick. I mean, I am good for my health. I mean, there was that one time I ate a sewer rat, but it was so so big that the uh, and that that was fairly tasty due to its size. But uh, afterwards, everyone else in town kind of looked at me funny because they thought I was carrying the plague. So I guess I'm healthier than most. Good old weapon mastery. Always can go for the uh, nice clean reverse stab. be going. Ship records, ship records, or are you? Ship records. Oh. 
maybe there's separate records on here. Ooh, a musket. Musket can't be all that bad. Capilili's coordination roster. Captain Capili, first mate Tupu, Chief Technical Officer Sailsa, Second Mate Hawa Pele, <laughs> Navigator Ekitone, Boatswain Arona, Rigger Hama Hamakukua, Surgeon Kikai, Engineer LeVay, Gunner Fiso, Quarter Mask with Sapani, Cook Rata. Is that a person or is that an order? And uh, Messman Philopi Hoppa. Interesting. I forgot that I needed to reload after every shot with a musket. This was not a good in the field planning choice. I said I wasn't strong, but a hammer has to be better than shooting a musket. Now, being a pistol leader, that's more my down my alley. Musket, not so much. Let's see. Manifest of the Coronation. Three crates of, three, yeah, three crates of bouillon. Hard tack ra rations. Two reels of parchment. Thirteen hatches, hatchets. Fifteen bows. Five crates of arrows. Is this my ship? Ah. Let's see. Capelli's coordination log day thirteen. Mutiny in the J thirteen. Mutiny is upon us. Both Swain or Arona has gotten in, in, into everybody's head, everyone's head, that the ship would be better off ran by him. And the whispers of the de descent have grown to a dull war roar below, below decks. I will have to reinstate my authority by many means necessary if we were to reach our destination in time. Kind of a crap captain, but at least you kept your rations, I hope. Didn't have an another person on the ship steal them for it from you. Be happy that you at least died with your rations.
Alright, on to the next 